everyone. Um, Happy New Year, I guess. I'm trying to remember the last time I made a video. It's been a little while. Uh, it may have been after New Year's, but I don't think it was after my birthday. Um, so I had my birthday on the 4th, and I had some friends over and did some cooking, and it was really nice. And I was thinking just today, I hadn't made a video in a while, so I thought I'd just come here and do a little check-in. Uh, obviously, it's still winter time, but we had it kind of warm over the weekend, and now it's cooling off, but we had some rain, and um, it's not really cold out, but I, it's the afternoon and the house really hasn't warmed up, so I'm making a little fire down here. Um, I have been doing some work for a local uh, property investor, just doing some online stuff for her, just finding trades to work on different properties and that sort of thing. And I have been using my new, um, my new uh, instant camera, the Lomo Instant Wide, and I've been getting used to that, been doing that. I finished my year-long project using doing drawings every day, so now I'm back to, uh, I've just sort of worked into doing blog posts daily and doing photos daily, and I'm trying to up my film photography game again and get some series going. The, uh, the ritual show, which is actually still up in, in Philly with the Heavy Bubble um, group, it, uh, it was the single sheet book show, and I think I showed on a previous video how to do a, a single sheet book. So three of the four I have in the show have sold, which I'm happy. And I found that um, one of the three that sold was picked up by Swarthmore College to go in their book arts and press collection. There were like eight books total that they, they picked up at the show, so I was happy about that. There's something that I made at Swarthmore College now <laughs> for whatever that's worth. And it did make me think I perhaps might want to go into some bookmaking, that kind of bookmaking, hands-on bookmaking, not um, through Blurb, although I still I still have my books there and I probably still will, will work with that at some point, but to do more of the hands-on stuff, I was thinking of doing that. Um, other than that, uh, life is kind of the same old, same old, um, just working at feeling settled and uh, working with what's right in front of me, not attaching too much to wanting to be someplace else or wanting to be with someone, uh, just working to be present with my day-to-day -day life and um, address things as they come up and be grateful for uh, what I do. Okay, I got a little phone call there, so sorry about that. It's the second time I've had uh, a call, let me put some wood in here, uh, from this number in Newport News, which is kind of weird because last time they didn't leave a message, and uh, I don't know anybody in Newport News, and they're not where I've been calling tradespeople. I've been calling people in Roanoke, actually, but that's neither here nor there. Um, I am just going to, uh, whatever, it's cool. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, so just uh, being present with my life as I know it and taking the steps to continue to uh, do work for money or sell artwork or I'm dog walking. I'm doing a dog walking thing every day. Who are these people that, who is that? That's just a text I can get back to later. It's kind of funny doing this work the way I am because 
it's like I put in my hours and then I having I have I still have to field calls even when I'm done like keeping track of my hours anyway but it's it's a good learning experience um, so what else do I want to say right now um, just life as I know it uh, I want to do um, some planning for the garden um, some trips I want to plan some little road trips out here there are people that I need to go see like Annie and some other friends um, and I'm waiting for winter we I don't know if we're gonna get any snow this year I know some people probably are sick of snow if you live like I know that Jude lives up in Maine and they get a lot of snow uh, there are places that I'm sure people are sick of it but in Richmond, I wouldn't mind a little bit. I wouldn't mind a little bit more hard freezes and chill just for the plants. But it was lovely this weekend. I did take a really nice walk around Pony Pasture. I used up some film. Avery had a good walk, so that was all good. Um, but, uh, you know, it, it is still winter, even though it's kind of confusing. But, you know, we all know how that is right now. Um, and other than that, I just wanted to say that if I'm not doing as many videos as I'd like, uh, I know I was chatting with somebody the other day who said, and you know who you are, uh, who said, oh yeah, I watch your videos, you know, just make videos, just talk, it's nice to have people talk, and it's, you know, that they like that, but I sometimes feel like I don't have anything, <laughs> anything I'm interested to say, and I'm sure I've said that before. Um, but you can follow me on my blog. I'll put the link down below. Uh, I'll put my website. I'll just put all my information down there. And even, I mean, I post on Instagram, but I don't feel like I post my, I post life snapshots. That's not my photographic work. That's not what I consider my photographic work or my artwork. Um, some people upload a lot of their work to Instagram, but I'm ambivalent about that practice, uh, but my Flickr is always having my work come up, and you should be able to view me even without a uh, even without an account. But you could always get a free account if you're not uploading anything, just to view people's stuff or to follow somebody. I completely support Flickr. They are now owned by another photo company, Smug Mug, who's dedicated to photographers. Um, their prices for putting a lot of photos up have gone up, but considering what you get for, uh, for the fee, it's, it's totally worth it to me as somebody who is a serious enthusiast or a professional, whatever you want to call it, so anyway, you can look at my stuff on Flickr, most of my stuff, um, and my blog, I said that already, because I don't, I just really don't know how much I'm going to be posting um, video. It's, uh, I so respect the people who can do a lot of videos, it's just, it's just really challenging for me. So. That's it for now. Just wanted to check in. I hope everybody's doing well in the new year and um, I will check in with you another time. Okay, bye.